tired everyone so let's go ahead and get started with the drill all we're simply doing here is hitting the ball and catching it upon return the reaction part of it is clicking in as the ball is coming towards me and the timing part is clicking in as I'm catching the ball and so what we're doing here is we're creating mind and body synchronization and I think this is really unique this is something that this tool brings to the table that allows you to work it in an isolated fashion uh, because there's really no pressure there's no one trying to you know hit your head off with the fist coming in um, you're just having fun it's really playful and uh, the ball is pretty quick too so it really allows you to train and uh, develop those those reflexes and get the timing down because having that timing down definitely puts you ahead of your opponent so here's a cool picture that I pulled up for you guys to kind of break down what's going on when you're using this tool so number one the balls approaching number two the eyes register the incoming ball which sends information to the visual lobe number three the occupational lobe of your brain sends the visual information of the incoming ball to the frontal lobe number four the frontal lobe decides that the incoming ball or object must be caught or dodged and again that can be simulated as a fist or a jab you know or a kick and um, your frontal lobe based off its training gets to decide what it wants to do to in order to respond to that um, after that your mortar cortex receives instructions from the frontal lobe and the mortar cortex sends signals to the spinal cord after that the spinal cord sends its signals to the hands um, let's say you're catching that or you're parrying that or to the neck because let's say you're slipping that to move out the way of the incoming punch uh, sends a signal and then once that signal is sent through the spinal cord your body begins to move in a specific location to achieve proper outcome so again if it's a jab you know you could either parry that and then come right on top with a cross um, again if it's if, if it's a jab you can slip you can move out the way you can weave under uh, multiple outcomes and that's what's unique about this ball is it allows you to train that mind and body connection in an isolated fashion all right so here's another video for you guys it's in slow motion to kind of give you guys a better visualization of how the ball is actually going in real time this would look pretty fast but uh in slow motion you can kind of see where the training's clicking in all right so i'm hitting the ball reacting towards it and catching it and uh, timing is really important especially as a mixed martial artist let's say if you're a counter fighter you want to be able to counter appropriately and for order in order for you to successfully pull a counter your timing has to be on point and uh, something really cool about this tool again it allows you to work on it in an isolated fashion and also the more you do it it allows you to override um, maybe some bad instincts that you have for example flinching or looking away uh, you don't necessarily always want to do that in a fight uh, because that's going to leave you susceptible for incoming hits uh, etc so this is a really fun tool again you can play with it and the more you do it the more you actually start to think less and you let your body and your training um, just click in and you almost get into like a flow state And again, I really think this tool could help mixed martial artists out there, whether you're a boxer, a Muay Thai fighter, uh, a karate practitioner, uh, whatever, you know, this is going to help you get that mind and body synchronization. All right, guys, so that wraps up today's video for the Acroball. We showed you guys a little bit of slow-mo, we did show you a drill as well, and we broke down a little bit of the science behind Acroball and how you can benefit from it. Now if you want to get your hands on this product, go ahead and check the link down below. It'll take you to the Amazon store where you can get it. And uh, hopefully you guys like this video, and uh, hopefully you guys like the demonstration. I really feel like this product has helped me a lot, uh, especially with my sparring. Uh, my timing and reaction is a lot more um, active, and I feel like this has definitely helped me with that. So again, if you want to check it out, go ahead and check the link down below in the description. Don't forget to like this video, give a comment below, and also hit subscribe. I'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you guys for watching.